Hi, Susie Goodwin with the Run Lift Mom podcast, and I am a podcaster who also has a couple of brands that I represent, so I sell things. Um, and one of the ways that I sell these brands is to do a lot of value first kind of stuff, um, including e-courses. So when somebody gets my lead magnet, they also get put into a five-day email course, and then they're on my email list, which I like because don't build your business on social media. So you're actually looking at one right now that I built in Aweber, which is my email server. Um, and it's a very, very simple, it's a landing page. And what a landing page is, it's not a fully functional website like Run, Lift, Mom Pod. It is simply a page that captures, in this example, someone's name or email, minimal information, and then they get my lead magnet, and then they're put into a campaign. I want to show you how I'm doing this, though, because it took me a customer service call. Um, so I've created that landing page in Aweber. So here's the dashboard. When you open up Aweber, this is what it's going to look like. You're going to go over here to landing pages. Now you can use Aweber's designs. I actually used um, the one that you see here is like a preset design that I just changed some of the copy. And um, you're, you're going to have it here. Now I want to show you if you've got multiple lead magnets going. So as an example, um, this podcast playbook one is going at the same time as a 5K training plan. So like a five-day e-course as well as a schedule template that they can download. Here's what you want to do to get them in the right campaign and then only be getting one e-course instead of all the things. Um, and at the end, of course, these folks will go, these segmented folks will go into your big email list. Um, so you've got the form here. Um, what you're going to do is under submission, here's where you want to add a tag. So in this example, I say podcast. Okay. That's really, really important because when you come back over here into my campaign, so here are my campaigns. When you come back over here into my campaign, I've got all my messages written out. And P.S. Aweber, you can copy and paste pre-written campaigns. If you are on my Zaya or my Alouette team, I will share my campaigns with you. Um, and so the trigger is applied when someone gets... Uh, when the tag podcast is applied, okay? So are you understanding that? They are over here and I have this landing page set up to tag as podcast. You guessed it, there's a similar tag on my 5K landing page that tags them as 5K. That means that this person wants podcast, right? Like once they give me their email address, it will tag them podcast and that is when this campaign begins. So that is when I'm able to come over here and day one begins, they get their lead magnet, go here to download it, and then it gives them some really great information over the course of five days. You guys, this took me customer service to figure out. Um, so remember, as you are creating landing pages, you will want to make sure that you do the tag that will trigger your campaign. So you've got landing pages and then campaigns to build out. Aweber is awesome.